Oh, hey, sorry, I'm just walking around here. Uh, I'm sorry, 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 sorry. What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Zach Blake here, and today we're continuing our playthrough of Hello Neighbor 2. That's right, today we are standing right outside the Creepy Museum, about to continue the game. If you haven't seen what happened last time, um, go check it out. I'll put it probably in the top or somewhere. But basically, we got a little letter that said, help me, and also was uh, right after we saw a letter of the museum, so now we're here. So I honestly don't know what to expect, but it looks so good. Um, oh wait, oh, yeah, that's the neighbor's shovel right there. All right, should, should I close the door behind me? Okay, so I guess we're just starting right away. Oh my gosh. First off, I always know that like, these little paintings always are like movable. What do we got? Uh, excuse me, uh, delivery. I am the mailman. I have some, some mail for you. Oh wait, can we? Yep, we can pick up his shovel. Oh, okay. All right, that was a cutscene moment. Oh no, okay. Quentin, hold it together, man. Hold it together. Can, oh, don't pass out. He's passing out. Okay. Hello? What? So I, I picked up a shovel and I just pass out. Okay, that's not. That's kind of not good. Okay. Nothing is working. Oh, this is giving me Hello Guest vibes. Oh my gosh. All the preparation. Here we go. Hey. Uh, sorry, there's nobody in here. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Oh. oh, geez. Okay. Oh! Gosh. Gosh. Why? Why? Okay, all right. Whew. So, do you know what that reminded me of? Way, way, way back in the day, we were playing Hello Neighbor, the first game, the alpha. The alpha was crazy because it always had these dream-like things. You know, you ran over to the neighbor's house, you got caught, it was like a dream. You would like wake back up, and then one day there would be like a giant neighbor. That's kind of what it reminded me of. I really like how they've like encapsulated the feel of Hello Neighbor 1, but also like elevated it for this second game of Hello Neighbor 2. Now, where's my flashlight? I'm all, I'm almost like looking for it because I forgot that was a dream. Oh, so my surveillance is now on the bakery, which looks opened. And I'm guessing that that's where I need to go next. All right, hello world. We are about to begin our journey today after visiting the museum. Right now, we have the mystery of the neighbor. We don't know what's going on. We know that somebody needs some help and we're presumably helping out Aaron, which is the neighbor's son. And in our beautiful town here, we are not going to stand for injustice. We are a journalist, a detective almost, you know? We are going to solve all of the crimes of this area and solve everything. I really hope that by the time this video, um, like the end of this video, I don't lose my voice. I could already feel it. You hear it? My voice is going away because I'm still sick. Literally every time that I stop talking, it's probably because I'm coughing. <laughs> wow, look at that. So we have the mayor, uh, his house over there, which is still kind of boarded up. And now we have our local bakery. And look at that, like these just like, Shadows and reflections. Oh my gosh. I've only dreamed of this, you know We used to play mods for hello neighbor and people would try like try to put a bunch of work into the detail and like This is what I would imagine it would look like all right So we have now arrived at the baking shop. Excuse me door door. I was trying to walk into there. It's closing on me Um, hello. Can I have your finest baked good? Can I have a croissant? Hello? Hi, I just wanted to say what's up. Oh, oh gosh. Why? For some reason, I thought she was about to like smack me. Okay, hi. Can I watch you? Can I see? Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna watch very closely. <laughs> oh gosh, what am I doing? I didn't want to do that. I literally climbed over the counter and I was like, excuse me. What are you making? Um, can I buy something from your shop here? I don't know how to purchase stuff. It looks very cool. Ooh, I know this painting probably cannot be moved. You know, normally they can. Well, um, since I am a creepy journalist that climbs and breaks into everything, why don't I just climb up here? She doesn't seem to be looking. All right, well, seems like we're doing a crime today and we are breaking in to this house. Um, or I guess it's the bakery top house, I guess? I don't know how to break in, hold on. I do have a lot of tools. We got got some criminal activity right here. Can I break this window? Do you think? Gosh. Okay. Yep. 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 You can break it. Now I'm gonna use my drone to see if like she actually cares, dude. I've been using this drone so much. Okay. So it seems like she doesn't care at all. I can actually keep an eye on her like that. Okay. We have now entered the house. We are now <laughs> stuck in here until we can figure something out because um, this is really dangerous. It seems like she knows. Uh, I am now looking at the drone. And she kind of has figured out that something is going on. I don't, I don't know what that means, but I'm glad I kept this out here. All right, I'm just gonna look at all this stuff. It seems like 
Like, everybody is always hiding something in this town. And you know what's also very strange? I didn't even really think about this until now. It's called, you know, Hello Neighbor. And normally, we refer to the neighbor as the neighbor, you know? But everybody in this town is my neighbor, right? Oh, look, more scissors. I guess we could have just, like, came here and got scissors, right? Wow, they changed everything about this place. We were playing this before, and it was, like, so different. So, there's something that I definitely need here. Ooh, it's probably this book. All right, now I think she's just right down there. Um, I probably don't want to alarm her, but let's find something in here at least. Ooh, okay, okay. So something has to be placed here on this clock. We basically know two things. This clock has to be open and there is a book that has a lock on it. Now, it's also very scary knowing that I'm just in somebody's house right now. And at any point they could just walk upstairs and be like, excuse me, police. Oh, but this door opens out to the outside. Huh. Oh, and there's like a secret. Oh, I guess it's not really a secret. Okay. Oh, I see though. And they gave us scissors right here in order to cut through here. What is in this? Oh, wait. Oh my gosh. She found me. Ah, what? What? How? What? When did she get up there? I mean, I'm surprised she just kicked me out instead of beating me up. I was like in her house cutting up her stuff. Okay, so I don't know what this is, but maybe it goes here. Oh, it does. It's the hand of the clock. I'm gonna hide. I'm gonna hide. I don't know what I heard or saw, but I think that she's in here. Oh my gosh, there she is. Hey! What? I mean, don't, I don't want to say hey, hey. Be quiet. Be very careful. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. So what does that do? Oh, so I can change it. I have to find a specific time. Maybe 1035, it says on that clock. Oh, there we go. Yeah, oh my gosh, I already did it. Yeah, seven. I have a seven. Oh no. Okay. Uh, nope, I'm not here. I'm not here. I'm not here. I'm not even, oh gosh, why'd she get so close? <laughs> she like licked my face. The set design of this place is so nice. To see all these little details is so crazy. It's so weird to think that this is like still Hello Neighbor. Like, I mean, look at that detail. Okay, so I need to now grab this piece again. I have no idea what this is. It looks like a button of some sort. So I actually made it downstairs and I see Imbir the cat has another one. Oh. And Imbir the cat just scratched me up. Okay, so Imbir, you want some food, right? Okay, 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 okay. So can we get Imbir some food? Oh, hey, sorry, I'm just walking around here. Oh, I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a customer, I, I wasn't over there. Oh, I see, these are the buttons. Okay, so I just put a button on. Okay, hey, I'm helping you out though, I'm eight. That was just her cash register. She, her cash register is broken. Oh, it seems like a lot of the food is hidden back here. There needs to be a key, but we also have, oh, a pipe. Oh my, oh, okay. I just took that, I guess. I'm, I'm taking this now. I am committing robbery. I will now be stealing your pipes. There we go, ha ha. Oh, Imbir is so cute. Oh my gosh. I'm just sitting back here. Imbir is literally like my food. Can you please get me food? Okay, is there any food back here to give to Imbir? All right, so uh, I'm continuing forward now. I'm gonna take the items that I got and see if I can figure out something up here. It seems like, so we have a pipe. We also need to get food. Is this, oh, that's perfect. So now what does that do? So if I go outside, does this do anything? What, what was that pipe for? Oh, and I can also cut these. Oh, I see another piece. It seems like every single level is like a super scavenger hunt. Oh my God. All right, I got the five. Now, where else? All right, doesn't seem like she's here. Let's put the five on. There we go. And in fact, if she's not here, maybe I just kind of walk around here. Did this change anything? What did that water do? Oh, I have to place something in there. Oh, like, like this. Okay, okay, okay. Place that in there. Come on, come on, come on. Where is she, where is she? Okay, now can we grab the key? Oh, it's too hot. How do I turn that off? Oh, maybe that's what was happening. I turned it up. All right, all right, all right. Oh, she's right there. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I gotta be stealthy about this. You know, she's walking around her house and I'm kind of being a menace. Okay, she's went downstairs. I'm now gonna turn off this. There we go. So I actually ran inside and I found this teapot. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it, but um, maybe I have to fill it with water. Excuse me, what do I do with this? Sorry, 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 sorry. Hey, please. Man, this is a very complicated puzzle. I'm only missing two 
and I, the key is in there. She's just staring at the key right now. <laughs> She's like, why is there a key in my oven right now? But look at her. She just can't stop looking at it too. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. Is that also a key? <gasps> she has a key on her. Oh, okay. Well, now I know what I must do. I have to break in there and steal that key off of her. Okay, so she's still staring. I'm gonna see if I can grab it. Oh, I'm gonna take this. So now I know I have to pick up some sort of like tea kettle. I don't know what that's for, but let's see, does this open up that? Oh, it doesn't, it doesn't. Oh, you know what it's for then? It's down here. It's to this. So what do we got in here? We got food, food. Ooh, this is for Imbir. Okay, shh, 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 Imbir. I'm gonna give you some food. There you go. There you go, Imbir. Now we trade. We trade, Imbir. Come on, come on. You eat your food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just grab this. Thank you. Okay, so now we got it. We just yeah, have one more and that's it. And then I think we need to know a code. So, uh, there we go. Oh, man. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry. Hmm. I have an idea. I don't know if this will work. What if we use the fire extinguisher to put out the, uh, the, the oven? I don't know if that'll work. But maybe it could. All right, I'm gonna try it. Go! Oh my gosh, it did work. Uh, okay, go, 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 go. Got the key, I got the key, okay, 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 okay. So now I just gotta go upstairs and unlock that book. All right, here we go. Is she up here? She is, hey, hey, hey. I'm not here, I'm not here, I'm sorry. Okay, she just went downstairs. I gotta be more stealthy, I really do. All right, so we're gonna unlock the book. What is in here? The last piece. Why is she hiding all this? Like, why did she dismantle her register for this? All right, well, I just put it on. Now, what's the code? 1576, maybe? Let's see, one, five, seven, six. Oh my gosh, it is. Okay, easy as pie. So I grab the key, does that mean now I take this to the museum? Oh my gosh! Sees the town working together to do something very creepy? I, I don't know. Now this is the same key that I saw on the, uh, what is it? The picture when we were inspecting the museum, uh, when we were in the basement. I know it sounds complicated, but this is the same key. So with this, we are now able to get into the museum. So let's see, can we? Oh, it is now unlocked. Oh, and there's the neighbor. Hi, how's it going? Oh my gosh! So, I think we've reached a new level now. Ooh, and I also grabbed the shovel, which uh, probably is gonna be very useful. It feels like everybody in this town treats me like they know me, and I'm sure everybody in this town knows each other, but it almost looks like they're like, ah, Quentin, here he goes, breaking into my house again. Man, th this museum is so giant. There's probably like so many ways to go about this, but I think this is kind of a good place to leave it. We did solve all of the puzzles. Everything felt pretty cool, you know? We went into the bakery area and just, I guess, just ran around and did whatever we wanted. So yeah, nevertheless, I'm, I'm gonna leave it here. I hope to see you in the next episode. Um, we're gonna try to continue to play through, have some fun, play some Hell and Neighbor 2. We've been waiting so long for it. It's, a re it's really exciting. But uh, yeah, I'll see you in that next episode. Thank you for subscribing and joining the DAC Packers. We're going to two million subscribers like I always say it blows my mind every single day I, I thank God that I'm able to do this be able to make you smile every single day and uh, you know what it, it's just amazing so I'm gonna go rest I didn't actually lose my voice I'm actually I'm happy you know but uh, yeah I'll see you in that next episode probably coming up right now I'll see you there thank you guys for watching and as always peace out my dudes